Hello everyone, welcome back to another video and in this video I will tell you why Duolingo is sick and how to fix it. So as you can see on my home screen here, my Duolingo app seems to be sick. So if you're new to Duolingo, this can be a bit strange and surprising to see, but it's actually quite common with the Duolingo app. From time to time, the Duolingo team will change the app appearance from tired to sick or etc. etc. just for marketing purposes. So when they change the app's appearance, people start talking about it on social media and it gets a bit more traffic to the Duolingo app. So that's the reason why the app icon changes from time to time. But if you're annoyed by this, there are a few ways to change the app appearance. If you're, if you're on iPhone, you can just download the old Duolingo app image and go to your settings and replace this icon with that new downloaded one. If you're on Android, I don't think you can do it, but alternatively, you can go to your Duolingo app, then click on your streak and scroll down a bit until you can see the app icon. Here, if you have a streak on Duolingo, you can turn this on. And by turning this on, this becomes the new Duolingo icon. So after a few seconds, the appearance of the icon changed on my home screen. Alternatively, you can just wait it out or go to your Google store, go to Duolingo, and then go to these three little dots in the upper corner. And here you can enable or disable the auto update. So in this case, I have auto update disabled. So I just manually update all my apps. And if you have your auto update disabled, you can avoid the Duolingo app appearance changes until you can see that the appearance of the Duolingo app on the Play Store is back to normal. So I would recommend that for a semi long term solution. So, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. It really helps the channel. Also, if you want to further support the channel, you can check my Buy Me A Coffee link in the description below. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.